Hello travellers, today we're taking a look at the new Turtle Pillow Plus, which is the latest version of the pillow I reviewed a few years ago. You can click up in the top right hand corner to see a review of that one. There's quite a lot that's changed from the first pillow, so let's take a look at the new design compared with the old one. Turtle also sent me the Turtle Flight Socks, which I'll be including a short review of a bit later on in this video. The first thing I noticed was that the new pillow is a little bit larger and slightly heavier, but it does include a nice water resistant carry bag with a built in carabiner, which makes it easy to clip onto and carry on your main backpack while traveling. The old turtle pillow was not height adjustable in any way, but the new one has a built in height adjustment on both sides. The new pillow also has more padding and a breathable mesh that allow more breathability and comfort while wearing for longer periods of time. The new Pillow Plus also has a softer, more plush feeling fabric on the inside that feels more premium than the original pillow. The process for wearing the pillow is the same as the original. You hold the main padded part of the pillow against the back or side of your neck and then loop the Velcro end around your neck and secure it until it fits snugly enough to support your head. The new Pillow Plus has two Velcro contact points, one at the top and one at the bottom, whereas the old version only had a single point of Velcro contact. This gives the new Plus version a more secure fit and a bit more support. In terms of comfort for sleeping on the plane, I can definitely feel that the new Pillow Plus is more comfortable over the old one. The ability to adjust the height makes it perfect for finding the right head position to get comfortable. I did find that the adjustment knob was a bit firm and difficult to turn in some situations. If for example you try to adjust it while leaning on it, the pressure from your head makes it difficult to turn. So it's best to turn the adjustment knobs whilst you're not leaning on them. They also do make a fairly audible clicking sound for some of the notches which can be a little bit annoying, but overall the adjustment is a nice feature to have. The turtle pillow can be worn comfortably with headphones, but I did encounter the same slight annoyance that I did with the original pillow. That is, at some angles, the inner support structure of the pillow can press against the bottom of your ear and kind of pop out the earbuds, or in some cases break the airtight seal of the earbuds in your ear, allowing sound to leak in. But this is just a slight niggle and can be easily fixed by adjusting the angle of the pillow so it doesn't press against your ear. The Turtle Flight Socks are a pair of compression knee-high socks that Turtle offer in a variety of colours and sizes. I have the large size and the Seattle colour. I don't often wear compression socks when I fly, so this was a new experience for me. But I did find these very comfortable and provided a little bit of extra warmth on the cooler air conditioned flights. The socks themselves are firm but not too tight and they don't feel super restrictive. It takes a little bit of rolling to get them on firmly and all the way up your legs. But once you do, they provide a good level of compression. If you're in the market for some compression socks or if you're buying the turtle pillow and want some compression socks, these would be a great companion for the pillow. Overall, I really like the new Turtle Pillow Plus, and I was able to get a good restful sleep whilst using the Turtle Pillow Plus and the Turtle Compression Socks, and I can highly recommend them over the original Turtle Pillow as a definite improvement in comfort and style. Even just for the included carry bag alone, I think it's worth the upgrade. So that's it, thanks very much for watching. Be sure to let me know down in the comments what you use for sleeping on the plane, and be sure to stay subscribed to keep up to date with future videos.